If you're a fan of So You Think You Can Dance Next Generation, you will know the name Tate McRae. She captivated Canadians and others around the world on the show. The team from Calgary was in fact the first Canadian contestant to make it to the end of the competition and ultimately finished in third place. To tell us about her journey on the show, Tate McRae joins me now from Los Angeles as well. Tate, hi. Hi, how are you? I'm well. How are you doing now that uh, the initial excitement has worn off a little bit? It's pretty crazy. I can't believe it went by so fast. I can't believe it's all over. Well, you did so well and everyone was so happy for you. But I do want to ask you this because it was a bit of controversy that you came in third because many thought you were destined to win. What did you think? I mean, I was super grateful to be here. I never expected to get this far in the competition. And I'm so proud of Kida because he deserved it. And at the end, it was America's favorite dancer. So it was all in America's hands and we couldn't do anything about it. Well, you're a good sport and you're taking it very well and saying all the right things. Yeah. Do, you, do you think it would have made a difference if uh, Canadians were able to vote? I'm actually not sure. I don't know how the voting worked, but it was definitely hard because none of my friends and family could vote and they were all behind me supporting me 100%. So I think that made a little bit of an impact, but I don't know. <laughs> sure. You know, the experience is unreal. You were on such a big stage and you had to learn new dances every week. How difficult was it and what was the hardest part? I think the hardest part would have to be saying goodbye to our friends every week, especially because we got so close in such a short period of time. and. We are all best friends by the end, and I'm so glad that everyone got to come back for finale. But we got so close, and then we got to say goodbye. We were all bawling and in tears, but I was so grateful that I made it to the end. How old are you again, Tate? Remind me. I'm 13 years old. I just turned 13. You have the grace and poise of someone much older than yourself. Uh, what's next for Tate McRae? I'm not sure. I mean, I'm just going to go home and keep on training and working as hard as I can. And hopefully new doors will open from this experience and hopefully new opportunities will come. Uh, are you working on anything that you want to tell us about right now? Not in the, I mean, not right now, but I'm just hoping the new thing will come. And I'm hoping that I'll, maybe I'll go get into the acting or maybe I'll keep on doing other things. But I'm, I'm not sure. Nothing's right now planned. Well, listen, I'm sure uh, you'll be hearing from a lot of people shortly. We appreciate your time and your talent. Thank you, Tate. Thank you so much. Tate McRae, so you think you can dance the next generation finalist.